Hi everyone and welcome to this course, this training, this series, this tutorial. This is PHP programming with Precious Iriel from Plicate Academy. I'm delighted and I hope you are delighted too. So without much ado, let's get into it. PHP programming. Introduction to PHP. PHP stands for PHP Hypertest Preprocessor -pre -pre and it's a programming language that allows web developers to create dynamic content that interacts with databases. PHP is basically used for developing web-based software applications and this tutorial is going to help you to build your base with PHP. So PHP is an acronym for PHP Hypertest Pre processor. PHP is widely used open source scripting language. PHP scripts are executed on the server and PHP is free to download and use. So you may be wondering if I want to get started with PHP, what do I need to know? All you need to know is HTML and CSS, possibly maybe bootstrap and also you can know a little bit of JavaScript or you might have no knowledge at all. It doesn't matter, but most important, you should understand HTML and CSS to get started with PHP programming. And why do you need to learn PHP? Because like you know, PHP started as a small open source project way back in 1994. It was started or it was created by Rasmus Ledoff and PHP is actually a must for students and working professionals who want to become great software engineers, especially if you're focused on the web development domain. So some simple advantages, PHP is a server-side scripting language and all you need to do is to embed it inside of HTML and it can help you to manage dynamic content, session tracking, you could even build entire e-commerce websites with PHP. Also, it can be integrated with numbers of popular databases like MySQL, PostgreSQL, Oracle, Sybase, Infomix, Microsoft SQL Server, and so many others. PHP is actually zippy in its execution quite fast, especially when it is compiled by Apache. It supports a large number of protocols like POP3, IMAP, LDP, LDAP. PHP is forgiving, that is, it's quite easy for you to get around, you know, with some little bit of errors, but this training is going to ensure that you are strict with what you do. And also, PHP syntax is like C programming language. So if you like C, then you will like PHP. And applications of PHP, I know you want to know this. PHP can be used, like we've said before, to perform system functions like from files on a system, it can create files, open files, read files, write to them, and even close them. PHP can handle forms, you know, gather data from forms, save data to a file, email the data to you, and even return the data to the user. You can add, delete, modify elements within your database using PHP. It can accept cookies, variables, and even set cookies. Using PHP, you can restrict users to access some pages on your website. And most important, PHP can help you to encrypt your data. So guys, this is it on our introduction to PHP. In the next videos, we'll be doing so much about PHP. I love PHP, and I hope you love PHP too. See you in the next video. Precious out.